Hello everybody, how you doing out there? How you doing out this is your street day, 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 another podcast, another day, another topic. It could mean anything, anything folks, but here we go for today's topic. Today's topic we're talking about a very special person who used to be, I should say, used to be uh, the press secretary of the White House. Now, she goes by the name of Sarah Huckabee Sanders, if that's what she wants to be called. Uh, we're talking about her right now at this very moment. Two years, uh, she was been in the uh, White House as press secretary of the White House. Very top order of the job. I think uh, the story went that I think Donald Trump hired her on, and uh, apparently she took that role very, very nicely, very nice. People got, sort of got used to her, uh, but now she's not in the Trump administration anymore. But she tried to get herself in there, sneaks herself in, and try to get, uh, make a name for herself again. Once again, I think she wants to be called Sarah Huckabee Sanders. If that's if that's what she wants to be called, I'll, I'll, I'll God forbid, I would do that. I will put her name in subtitles, and I will do that. I will do that. Okay, I'm not teasing her. I'm not, uh, you know, or anything like that. Remember, folks, she used to be in the Trump administration for two solid years uh, as being press secretary. Can you believe it? Two solid years, top job in the world. That's in tall order, as they say, tall order. Uh, but anyway, you get paid when you work for the government. Seriously, when you work for the government, you get paid, folks, uh, for doing that. A lot of people don't have jobs these days. And I'm not blaming on Sarah Huckabee Sanders for that. It's just uh, sometimes Donald Trump points these people to be where they want to be. Essentially, this is a real job. This is not like... Uh, this is not like a 9 to 5 job, this is a real job. This is like uh, the, the top of the food chain. So that means you're working for the uh, uh, the White House, that means you're working for uh, the job that she had, this is where her role was, was being press secretary of the White House. She was doing the briefing room. Uh, this was for two solid years, according to the story I've heard. Uh, so yeah, I'm going to tell you guys right now, I'm going to give her some kudos. I'm going <laughs> to, I'm not trying to expose her, but I'm trying to is get her uh, to be where she at. She's trying to weasel her in, in the Biden administration again. Uh, not only Trump administration, but Biden administration. I thought about her several times as a, as a week or so ago. Uh, she used to be with the uh, Donald Trump administration. But they, I think Donald Trump either fired her or she left on her comments, as they would say. Uh, but yeah, she left uh, the uh, Trump administration to uh, work on different things in her, in her little, as they say, little world, I guess. Anyway, uh, we're going to talk about her today. I, I'm trying to figure out how she wants to be pronounced, the uh, way, way her name is supposed to be pronounced. Does she want to be called Sarah Huckabee Sanders? Is that what she wants to be called? Or is it Sarah... Sanders Huckabee. I'm wondering, I'm just wondering, folks, is how she wants to, you know, like in someone's name, in someone's name, how she wants to really see herself. Is it, is it the right pronunciation? Is Sarah Huckabee Sanders? Is that what she wants to be called? Is, it what, is that what Donald Trump says to her? Uh, says that that's her real name kind of thing? So I'm assuming that's her real name. That's her full name. And, uh, and that's such a so she has a first name, middle name, and last name. Uh, so yeah, I, I hope I said I hope I said her name properly. Um, she was once uh, in the Trump administration for two solid years. People didn't realize that uh, for being the uh, press secretary that she was. Uh, but yeah, these are two people who were in the Trump administration uh, for. Uh, and can you believe it? Donald Trump was in there for four solid years. Four solid years. And that amount of time, they had two uh, press secretary of state. Or is it, pre yeah, press secretary. Uh, with it, what's, the, what, what's the qualifications that they need? <clears throat> but anyway, yeah. So, folks, this is a tall order in the uh, Trump administration. Ever since Donald Trump was in the Trump administration as president of the United States for four solid years, uh, they had different, different press secretary people. It doesn't matter if it's a man or a woman. Just, it just got to, they got to fill that spot, as they say. They got to fill that spot. That means being press, pre, uh, <coughs> press secretary, 
uh, do the briefing room in the White House, which you people probably see around 2 o'clock. Uh, yeah, uh, Sarah Sanders did a good job. I've seen a couple times of her uh, doing that uh, position. And she did it very good. She did it very good. Uh, I just I just got no I just noticed of her because of uh, the position that she was in uh, of the Trump administration. Uh, and people got notice of her. She was on two o'clock around the two o'clock hour in the afternoon, and she got a lot of exposure out of uh, being the press secretary lady in the White House. And that's tall order, folks. That is really big tall order. Uh, that's a paying job. That's what you call a paying job in the government. And can you believe that a person like her, her stature? Uh, would be in that position. It's it's a tall order, folks. And she has to deal with the media people. Um, it's not just being president of the United States or anything. So this is a tall order. We're going to talk about her today. I've been thinking about it for a while, for a, a, quite a bit, you know, from a week or so. Uh, so we're going to, I, I wonder, I'm, I'm just saying to you people, should we call her Sarah Huckabee Sanders? Is that what she wants to be called? Uh, her, that's her full name. Remember, that's her full name. Um, so we're going to talk about her right now, folks. Uh, I'm going to try and not really expose her in any way. I want to give I want to give her benefit of the doubt. She was a great press secretary, as long as uh, and that other lady who is now in the press secretary, I forget her name, Caitlin or something. I don't know what's her name. Anyway, uh, these are both people that I have uh, the utmost, as they say, the utmost uh, regard to. Uh, in the Trump administration. These are people who are press secretary of the White House, the briefing room. Uh, the, they, t uh, they take questions to the media and it's like, um, it's like what Donald Trump has said and give it to the media people kind of thing. So, she, they speak for Donald Trump in the briefing room. And that's sort of what that means. So, it was a tall order for her. I was surprised that she even landed that position. So, here we go, folks. We are going to talk about this right now. Uh, right now about her. Right now, we're going to not really expose her in a way that she doesn't want to be exposed. She's already got a lot of exposure on YouTube. A lot of videos out there. A lot of media people, you know, not really expose her, but just uh, really what, she, what her talking points are. Uh, what her talking points are. So we're going to explain versus her versus the other uh, press secretary lady. So, <laughs> um, so I hope this is her full, full name. This is what I'm seeing on the YouTube videos. Um, she goes through different changes in her hairstyles, to her face, to her, uh, her mood. I say her mood. Whatever her mood strikes her, I guess. Uh, she's either in a good mood or a bad mood or an unhappy mood. We'll, we'll just say it like that. But anyway, we'll talk about her right now along with the current press secretary. Doesn't matter if it's a woman or a man in that position, okay? So we're going to talk about her. Uh, we'll give her a little exposure. Now, I hope this is her full name. I'm assuming that it is.